Last week, we discussed the impact of both federal and state governments upon library services and administrative structure. This week, we'll turn to an even more complex topic, the public library in the context of its individual political placement within the funding district. As we shall see, funding and administrative structure can get extremely complex even within a given state. There is very little uniformity nationwide in the way libraries are placed within their individual communities. I want to spend some time emphasizing how important it is to understand that public libraries by and large are agencies of local government. They compete with other publicly funded agencies for resources, funding, personnel, and city services. As we shall see, one of the exemplar libraries I shall use throughout this course is stymied in many ways because they do not have control over their own IT, but depend, to a shocking degree, on the city IT department, and the less said there the better. The other library does have control over its own IT, but the director tells me that phone service, of all things, is a source of friction between the library and the city. And we haven't even begun to get at the vagaries of human resources departments and unions yet. Now make no mistake about it, public libraries, with few exceptions, have to compete with the fire department, the police, and the guys who pick up the garbage for resources. We simply cannot pretend that politics is not involved when the city bean counters are starting to hand out money. If you thought the public library was a nice, safe haven free from politics, you are sadly mistaken. A long ago student of mine fiercely resisted this notion. About two years after she went off to be the children's librarian on the coast of Maine, I heard from her to the effect that I'd been right after all. Rather than recoiling in horror, she had formed an alliance with the fire chief to bring high-speed internet to the town. The position within the town or funding agency of the public library is one of those realities of life with which you have to both understand thoroughly and deal if you are going to be an effective librarian. Some, or many of you, may become small-town library directors about the time the ink is drying on your degree. Some of you may not reach that peak until some time passes, but eventually, unless you are geographically bound, you'll be looking at an advertisement for a directorship and thinking, why not? At which point, I hope you remember some of this. On to the complexities of local settings. Context is everything. 